In comparison to the use of cables, the introduction of Wi-Fi has made things a lot easier for homeowners. You can use Wi-Fi to keep an eye on your children, start the coffee machine, turn on electronic devices, and so on. But have we considered the negative consequences of this technology? The Wi-Fi from your home router, which connects all of your gadgets, accomplishes this work via EMF radiation known as radio frequency. The radio frequency that provides you with internet access appears to be exceedingly harmful, especially when inhaled in significant concentrations. There are two major points of view on the impact of radio frequency exposure on your health. One group claims that using Wi-Fi is absolutely safe and has no long-term consequences. These believers are what I refer to as the smart and techie ones. They adore the concept of a house where everything is controlled via Wi-Fi. The second group believes that extended radio frequency exposure is hazardous to all living beings. Since it's impossible to say which viewpoint is correct or incorrect based on scientific evidence, I believe the truth lies somewhere in the middle. Wi-Fi's effects on humans. One of the main reasons why studies haven't reached a conclusion on the effect of Wi-Fi is that Wi-Fi radiation doesn't induce symptoms that can be diagnosed right away. As a result, many of us will opt to ignore any negative consequences of using it. Continuous radio frequency radiation may interfere with our body functioning, resulting in diseases such as cancer and neurodegenerative diseases. It's difficult to conclude or claim that the level of exposure to the wireless signal causes these ailments because they grow over time. Wi-Fi signals have been linked to producing the following health effects in humans. 1. Wi-Fi can make you sleepless. Check your Wi-Fi if you're having trouble sleeping at night or if you're not getting enough sleep. It's possible that's what's causing the problem. Insomnia is more probable in people who use Wi-Fi regularly before going to bed. EMF radiation from Wi-Fi connections has been demonstrated to have an effect on sleep patterns. Continuous exposure could lead to other issues including hypertension and depression, which are linked to a lack of proper rest. 2. The effects of Wi-Fi on your child's development. Wi-Fi network radiation has been demonstrated in studies to have a harmful impact on a developing fetus in the womb and to hinder the growth of a young child. Exposure to EMF radiation has been linked to asthma and obesity in young children, both of which can be harmful to the child's health. EMF radiation's effect on a developing fetus was not taken into account by safety guidelines. Read about the impact of Wi-Fi on babies and children in my article. 3. Affects the cell's ability to grow. According to dailymail.co.uk, a recent investigation in Denmark found that Wi-Fi radiation renders plant growth obsolete. Two sets of students participated in the experiment, one group plants in a room with no Wi-Fi radiation, while the other group plants in a room with radiation. The plants that were exposed to radiation never grew, whereas the plants in the controlled, Wi-Fi free, environment thrived. This finding is accurate, verifying a scientific study on the effects of EMF radiation on cells. 4. Causes a decrease in brain activity. EMF radiation has been found in scientific studies to reduce brain function. 5. Male and female fertility is reduced. EMF radiation released by Wi-Fi has been linked to fertility issues in both men and women. For men, exposure can diminish sperm motility and cause DNA defragmentation in the quality of sperm cells. The heat released by computers has the potential to damage sperm cells entirely. EMF radiation can prevent egg implantation in the womb and potentially result in an abnormal pregnancy in women. 6. Makes you more likely to get cancer. This condition is caused by cell phone and Wi-Fi radiation. People who are exposed to a lot of EMF radiation are more likely to acquire cancer, but it doesn't imply those who aren't aren't at risk. Small levels of EMF radiation may not harm you right now, but long-term exposure may cause problems. 7. Contributes to cardiac arrest. EMF radiation from Wi-Fi can raise a healthy person's heart rate or create erratic heart rate in vulnerable people, which can be fatal. Many routers have a feature that allows users to turn off connections automatically and then turn them back on whenever they choose. If you decide to switch off before going to bed, this feature will come in handy. It's generally a good idea to keep your exposure to a minimum. Thanks for watching. If you enjoy our content, please like, share, and subscribe.